Well, I'm, I'm a person who likes new experiences. And when I was asked to be a judge on Dancing with the Stars, it was clearly a new experience for me. Um, I've never really been that musically inclined, nor do I have that much uh, musical uh, ability or capability. Uh, so this was, uh, for me, uh, uh, a new challenge. It was um, a very uplifting, when the time came, it was a very uplifting experience for me. And it was just very relaxing and a lot of fun. Um, the things I didn't realize beforehand was this was a great opportunity for me to bring on some creativity because we had to develop uh, our own lines, our, our one-liners. Um, well, my, my, my feel, my, thinking back on the experience, I would, uh, I would recommend that the judges be brought in at the first rehearsal um, so that, and, and the, the producer sits down with the judges and talks about the expectations. Uh, getting, uh, learning about the expectations four hours before the performance, uh, it, is, it turns out to be a little tight because you're, you're asked to um, educate and you're asked to entertain. And I mean, if you really want to do a good job, you need some time to go think about that. And you need, I mean, maybe some people don't, but you need a little bit more than four hours to put that all together. Um, so um, I didn't know we were going to get, get a script, nor did I realize how scripted the whole performance, you know, really was. Um, but but was able to to adjust to what what it required. But I really would suggest that uh, we don't have to come to every rehearsal, but there be a be, the beginning start about you know the the, the day that the uh, dancers get together for the first time. We get briefed in terms of what our role is, and then I think we could go away and be and be. I mean, you had a choice. You could have either used the script that was provided. Uh, the one-liners that were provided, uh, or you could uh, create your own, and this would give you a chance if you wanted to create your own uh, to do so, uh, because in 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 some cases um, uh, the script may not be appropriate for the type of audience that you have in this community. Now you're lucky you had Mary Lou in between you, because she gets she doesn't need a script for anything. Yeah, she just goes. You know? Yeah. Um, you know. Okay, so there you were. You were unscripted, ready to go, just four hours before the show. So let's take it from there. Um, well, you know, what, what I did was, um, after I understood what the role was, I did come back and, and I, I really did appreciate having the person and the dance that, knowing who the person was and the dance they were going to perform. And so I, I came back and I did my homework and I was, um, you know, able to come up with uh, some, a one-liner that I thought would be appropriate for that person and for the uh, type of dance that they were doing. Uh, so I did my homework uh, and I felt pretty comfortable uh, when, I, when I came uh, to um, Showtime and the real performance. I didn't... I didn't consider them so much their, their celebrity status. I, I um, considered them as entertainers, and I was uh, really looking for um, how they danced, how they performed, yeah. how relaxed they were, how, how in rhythm were they to the uh, music that was presented to them. So to, to me, who they were was unimportant. Uh, I think. Oh, she absolutely loved it. She, she had the same feeling as I did. Uh, she thought uh, that, that it was entertaining. She liked, loved the format. Uh, she was uh, totally, she totally enjoyed the evening. Oh. As did my daughter, Carly. Yeah, she really liked it. Yeah, too. that's good. So if I said to you, Bob, uh, why aren't you going to be dancing next year? What would you say? Oh, I'd love to dance next would year. Would you? <laughs>
<laughs> no, it would be it would be fun. I you know it, it I, I debated in my mind you know the makeup of the judges and and whether it should be um, entertainers, you know, you know sort of professional entertainers, or just you know, people like me, in, you know, in a, in a sense. And I just think the balance that, that, right. that was there was perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, well, I, you know, too, I, I, thought, I thought it was a very nice job of selecting the range of celebrities that, that you did. I mean, there was, there was a, it wasn't all politicians. It, it wasn't all uh, uh, television, radio personalities. Uh, it, it was a cross-section of the community. Sure, sure. And and um, some well less n less known than others. Yeah, absolutely. And and I thought that the the personally, I thought how they they paired the person to the dance was smart. Was very good. Yeah, I mean, I, 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 yes, I, I the younger people did uh, the faster moving dances. The older people did the slower moving dances. But I thought it was in great balance. It, it was it was something that the Tri Cities doesn't have, uh, and it brought a new dimension to the Tri Cities. It really did, and and I'm really glad that when when I re when I read Beth's note that she wanted to do it again, I said, right on. This this could really take off. Yeah, our, 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 we wanted to fill that thing. We did not fill the the top. Uh, what did you think about the price? We thought it was low enough. Oh, yeah. The, I, yeah, I, I I've done another another thing about in you know in the Tri Cities um, when I, I was involved in Soundbite at Tri Cities where they brought in Chris Bowdy and and the price point was always the issue, um, and and personally I thought our price point was too low. I thought your price point was about right. Um, you could have probably gone to thirty five bucks, you yeah. know, a little bit more, but but I thought it was fair. Yeah, and and you know too. To Bob and I, and I should have mentioned this earlier on. Um, I, I thought, uh, part as part of the format, having having uh, uh, the a a, a um, the celebrity pick a charity and do it for a charity was, was brilliant. Was really right on. Ultimately, having the audience vote for the winner, and you know, from my vantage point, uh, they picked the right winner. Uh, you know, she was good with.